Hey there, today we are unboxing the real great Wing Gundam EW. The box art is just like the other real great kits, featuring the mobile suit in full on the right, as well as a headshot on the left. Looking at the bottom of the box, we have another headshot, the inner frame, the kit in its transformed state, as well as the kit in its normal state. The top of the box shows a couple of action poses. Now for the contents of the box. Starting off we have bag 1 with the stickers, as well as a multicolored runner. The second bag has the inner frame, as well as two more multicolored runners. The third bag has a white runner, as well as a full blue runner. And the last bag has more of the white pieces, as well as a set of grey parts. Finally, we have the manual. The front of the manual has a nice close-up headshot. The back shows the kit from all sides with its sticker locations. Opening bag 1, we have a sticker sheet with on the top left the foil stickers, with the rest being the normal stickers that leave a lot of visible borders on your kit. It would be nice if more kits would come with water decals. Besides the stickers we also have the first runner, which contains the red wing and shield pieces, some grey weapon pieces, and some yellow detail pieces. In back 2 we got 3 runners, starting off with more red pieces, 2 beam sabers, some clear pieces including the face piece that makes up the eyes and the inside of the head, and we got some white armor pieces. Next we got a runner with some yellow parts including the V-fin, some white armor parts, the blue armor parts and some more yellow at the top. And finally we got the multi-shot inner frame parts. Apparently one of the blue pieces didn't want to be part of his runner anymore. In the third bag got the full blue and full white runners. The blue one seemingly being the wings as well as some armor parts. The white one also containing wing pieces, some armor and the top of the hands. The last bag contains a white runner as well as a grey runner. With the white one being D1, having the same parts as the white runner from the last bag with an extra shield piece and some small headgear items. Grey Runner has a lot of small detail pieces that will probably be around the outside of the frame, as well as the hands and some joints. I will be working on getting some customization into this kit when I'm building it, so make sure to watch out for the upcoming build logs. If you like videos like these, give it a like and consider subscribing. If you have any comments or suggestions, leave them down below and I'll make sure to respond to them.